First up, some great news from RB side. Barcelona have officially renewed Alexis Olmedo's contract until 2027. The young talent is currently doing pre-season with the first team, and we're excited to see what he brings to the squad. At FC Barcelona B. The Nico Williams transfer saga continues to unfold. The emergence of PSG in the race for Nico Williams has raised some doubts at Barca. Despite this, our club remains optimistic. According to Alex Bindanel, Barca assures that they can pay the release clause and register him. However, it's reported by Ev Polo that PSG are not only offering Nico Williams double the salary that Barca are offering but are also planning to pay Athletic Club more than the winger's release clause. Barca are determined to secure Nico Williams and are continuing to work on this issue. They would like to complete the transfer quickly but have not set a deadline. Barca say they are prepared to pay his release clause and are now waiting for the green light from the player. At Polo. Additionally, Barca are awaiting an agreement with Nike to finalize the Nico Williams transfer. If Nike pays the money on time, Barca will carry out the operation with it. If not, the club has a plan B. At Alfa Martinez. Despite PSG's interest, Barca are reportedly ahead in the race to sign Nico Williams. The French club is trying to find an agreement with the player, but it won't be easy. At Fabrice Hawkins. Former player Thiago has been making waves in the dressing room. Regularly involved in training exercises, his high level has surprised many of the current players. It's great to see Thiago still making an impact. At Alex Pintanel. The operation to bring in Mikel Marino has stalled for the moment. Barca are currently focused on securing Nico Williams. At Psans. These are decisive hours for the future of Tadibo. He is set to join Juventus, and Barca will receive 20% of the sale. We'll keep an eye on this development. At Sport. Looking ahead to preseason. Hansi Flick and the new Barca staff have scheduled an intense training regime in the United States. Over 10 days, they have planned four double training sessions, plus an afternoon session after landing in Baltimore on the 31st. At Martin, mine and underscore. Flick has also been experimenting with different La Masia youngsters for the defensive midfielder position. It's exciting to see our young talents getting a chance to shine. At Mundo Deportivo. That's all for today's update, Barca fans. Stay tuned for more news and insights as we follow all the latest developments. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more FC Barcelona content. Visca El Barca